The Council for Quality Growth considers the four pillars of leadership and success to be quality, responsibility, vision, and integrity. Tonight, we celebrate Mr. John Portland for his leadership and his accomplishments, for his many, many unsung contributions to our great city, which have played a central part in who we are and how we live and to our great success. When you look at the creation of Atlanta, you have to talk about John, America's Mart, Peachtree Center, all the iconic buildings. It's the identity of Atlanta. He created the identity of Atlanta. So we owe him a great debt. He really put us on the map uh, in terms of the city of Atlanta with all the great developments that he created. And, and you know, he made uh, urban lifestyle, you know, very fashionable here in the city. This is one man who took art, architecture, economics, marketing, and raised to the heavens. We thank you, John and Jan, for your integrity and for giving it all in our city. What the eyes cannot see, the heart cannot feel. Mr. Portman, thank you for sharing your vision with the world and thank you for helping us to feel so much. John Portman is a true visionary. He transformed the landscape of downtown Atlanta and other cities across the country and across the world. John actually saved downtown Atlanta back in the 60s when I was president of the city council and then mayor. Uh, without him, downtown could have died because he stepped forward and built all those office buildings and skyscrapers. I think he brings a certain degree of uh, creativity and vision uh, that is hard to come by. So I think he's been incredible for the uh, region. Atlanta was in his blood, and he was determined to make Atlanta a great international city. So he was most important to the emergence of Atlanta as a great city, which then affected their region, and it was the cornerstone which brought the southeastern region, this area, into prominence in the world. Thank you for your vision. Thank you for your leadership. Thank you for your courage, the courage to take risks. I also want to thank the Council of Quality Growth and its leadership. I wish the organization many more years of success in pursuing your important work. Being in my own backyard, where everybody's known me forever, and as a matter of fact, I may be the oldest person left, but it was great. Atlanta is my heart. I have loved it from the first time I entered it, and I've always stuck with it and believed in it and had faith in it and still do, and it's got nothing but the best is yet to come.